I am Miles Richardson. I am Kilsly Kaji Sting of the Eagle Clan of Joth of the Haida Nation, my nation. When we're considering the role of the Assembly of First Nations, we must be aware of what it is and what it isn't. It isn't a government. It doesn't have the mandate to negotiate and speak on behalf of the participating First Nations. Each First Nation is sovereign in their territory and will speak for themselves. We must stand up and be who we know we are. If the Crown in right of Canada does not honor the existing treaties, what's the point of negotiating new ones? In many senses, Indigenous people in their relationship with Canada are at a crossroads. There's really two choices. Continue and try and fix this path we're on, the Colonial Indian Act path, or make a new choice. And this is the choice I stand for. We need to establish a respectful nation-to-nation -nation relationship between our peoples and Canada. We need to close the social gaps. For example, water. Why in this country, in this day and age, do some of our people still not have clean, potable drinking water for their day-to-day -day lives? How can children grow up healthy in that kind of an environment? We must address language issues. We must ensure that in partnership with Canada, we work to undo the damage of this colonial period of the residential school era, where our language were beat out and snuffed out of our people. As we go forward and, and build a renewed nation-to-nation -nation relationship, we must remember all that we have in common. We have much more in common as human beings and human societies than we have dividing us. I remember getting this really stark insight when I was lamenting to one of my elders one day about all the tough things that had happened to our people. And I was talking about losing our language, our ceremonies, our culture. My elder looked up at me and like I was a, a naive young man, which I probably was, and said, you know, all of those ceremonies and songs and language and culture that you're talking about having lost, he said, they haven't gone anywhere. He said, they're in the same place our ancestors found them. They're in the forest, they're in the trees, they're in the ocean, they're in the swimmers, they're in the sky world, they're in the winged ones. He said, before you take another step forward, take a step back and remember how to listen. I know that our First Nations are the equal of any nation on this earth. If you agree with my vision for establishing a proper nation-to-nation -nation relationship with Canada, I'm asking for your support on the 25th of July at the Assembly of First Nations AGM in Vancouver. Hawa!